ladies and gentlemen, this is the Mod Pippi and Emperor back with the next round of the Pokemon card tourney. So, here is our top four going into round three of, I think I put six rounds. I don't remember exactly how many rounds I put. Those are our top four. So, Moonstarter will be playing Blagar, Paul Perverse, Executor. They're all 2 0. Then. 1-1, one, one, Vespa Quen vs. Golurk, Dustox vs. Voltorb Reverse, Unfazant vs. Ninjask, and then Binnacle's 1-1, one, one, playing a 0-1-1 one, one, Shuppet, 0-1-1 one, one, Shuppet vs. Pikachu, and then 0-2 Voltorb and Talo, Pikachu is 0-2 as well. So let's kick this into high gear. I don't really know what I'm saying. So, let's, I'm going to do both of the first place, and then I'm going to give some recaps. So, yeah, because everyone wants to witness the first place matches. Musharna rolls 10, Gligar, 4. Musharna uses Prey... Prognostica stream what however it's called is asleep rolls wakes up Gligar tries to use stun poison and it works Musharna is paralyzed and poisoned in between turns ten damage and then in between turns she gets unparalyzed Gligar's turn. Stun poison. Fails. Musharna uses Psybeam. 60 damage onto Gligar and it is confused. And Gligar risks it all and uses Stun poison. Tails. Gligar loses and Musharna is the victor. Congratulations, Sharna. And our last 2 0 match Pelipper and Executor. Pelipper rolls a 5, and Executor rolls 8. Here, I'm going to switch them in for. Executor shakes it off for nothing. Pelipper can't do anything. Shake it off for nothing. Swallow does 30 damage. Seed, then Seed Bomb does good amount of damage. And then Water Pulse gets Executor up to 100 damage and is asleep. Now this dice roll matters. If this is heads, Executor wins. If tails, Pelipper wins. Heads. Executor wakes up and wrecks Pelipper. No other way to put it than that. So, Musharna and Executor playing next round. But Golurk and Vespa Quinn are going to battle. See you on the recap. And we are back, boys. So, Golurk beat Vespa Quen. You can see that there. The stocks obviously beat Vespa So, this is a match that I just wanted to get on camera. Because this seems like an interesting match. Infazant versus Ninjask. So, let's see what happens. Five versus eight. So Ninjask can't do anything. Infazant can't. Ninjask, 30 damage. Gets two clones. Infazant just feather dances away. And now this doesn't even matter. Ninjask, after Image Soul, 60 damage. These have one there. And he gets... Two more clones. This counts for uh, dam for energy, FYI. Umfazant uses Sky Attack. We have to roll. Heads! 
Pleasant wins. Yeah, it it was either like long game with Ninjask dealing like 90 damage. It, like Ninjask was just going to win next turn dealing 90 damage. Wow, that would have been cool. But Ninjask sadly lost. Now, I will see you. Now, see, like my editing, well, not really editing, I'm using uh, YouTube Capture, but eh, good enough. So, Hyrule, Voltorb gets 12, Taylor gets 7, Voltorb, Thunder Wave, Double Pack, does 10 damage, and then Big Explosion kills Taylor, and... Gives Voltorb the win. So, now here is something surprising. I'm actually doing two rounds in one episode, in one part. So, see you in three, two, one. And we have this round's matches. So, it is Musarna vs. Executor, Gligar vs. Unfazan. But yeah, this is 3-0. 2-1. Dustax vs. Pelipper, 2-1. Ulrich vs. Binnacle, 2-1. Ninjask vs. Voltorb, Revert. Oh, no. These guys aren't that high. Uh, Ninjask vs. Voltorb reverse. That is, uh, whatever you call it. It's 1 2. That's Pokemon vs. Pikachu. 1 2. Voltorb Torb vs. Shuppet. Uh, Voltorb 1 2. Shuppet 0 oh, 2 1. Shuppet 0 oh, 2 1 vs. Taylor 0 oh, 3. Now, to be honest, here is my scoop on who I think will win and all that stuff. So. Musharna and Executor basically are automatically in, especially the winner. Unless, wait a quick sec. Yeah, so the winner of this probably just needs to win their next round or the round after that, and they're almost definitely in. But the other one's probably going to get in also, because it's six rounds, FYI, if you didn't know. And yeah. So, Musharna and Executor, I think, are going to make it. Unfazan might make it, only if it gets lot really lucky, though. Dustax, I personally think, is going to make it. And then Pelper and Golurk are my, like, fourth place fish. So, I think first is going to be the winner of this. Second place, I think, is going to be Dustox. Then third loser of this, fourth, either Pelipper or Golurk. So let's just get these matches started. Most important match. Seven. Oh, yeah. Just this is just my own mindset. I'm gonna take this off really quickly. These four, these three are out of it. Not gonna win. Uh, these five that you can see in this are all the ones that are like have to win every game next to make it. And then two, I don't think Binnacle's going to make it, Gligar or Infazan, so those three stand pretty good. And yeah, I, yeah, you guys already heard me talk about them. Yeah. Now back to the game. Seven and eight. Executor goes first with a shake-off of nothing in Percot, however you call it, Dream. Asleep gets all of its energy. That actually makes a lot of sense. Go to bed, you get a lot of energy. And heads awake. Executor can't do anything. 
and Psybeam. And it's pretty obvious that no matter what, Executor cannot win now. Musharna is almost indefinitely going on to the final, to the tournament, like the real tournament with all those people. Yeah, I'm probably just going to do recaps for the first, I don't know, three, four rounds, because it, it, you'll, I don't it, I'll figure it out and stuff. <laughs> okay. So, uh, I think I'm going to do the uh, next match off screen, then the one after that on screen, and then not really show any else. Okay, and due to pure luck, Ligar beat Unpheasant, or Unpheasant, however you pronounce it. And to be honest, I thought Gligar was going to lose that. Wow, Gligar is really showing to be a fierce competitor. Well, but I'm probably underestimating it since it's a stage one. And just look at where it is in competitive video game battling. Cough, cough, you, you. The only uh, pre-evolution that does better than it is Chansey. And that's because Chansey, Evil Light, Beast, Dustax, roll 7, Pelipper, 6. So Dustax use it, can't do anything, neither can Pelipper, and Psybeam onto Pelipper. Now, he tries to use Swallow. Oh yeah, it's 2, but I'm... Not really going to keep track since I really don't care. Oh, I should probably move him on. And Tails, that gets it up to 60. Does Psybeam. Tries to swallow its pain. Wait, no, it doesn't even matter anymore. Dustox wins. It mattered if... Uh, what would have had to happen is it would have had to get that swallow last turn and then awake from being asleep and use water pulse. Uh, no, I think it would still even lose then. Wow. Dustox just wrecking it. And I will see you guys on the flip side. Okay, and we are back. So, yes, you guys saw... That. Yeah, I did, Mom. Sorry about that. Uh, so Golurk won. Vespa, I mean Ninjask won. Vespa won. Voltorb won, and Taylor won. So, see you guys next time. Cause this is Mud Kitty and Emperor signing out.